Greetings to you. Bishop Better here, your bishop, coming to you on this first Friday of Lent. Uh, we're just starting out these first steps. So if you haven't had some time yet to kind of get into Lent, now's the good time to. Uh, an encouragement for you, and you'll see it. We're going to post it back on this uh, Facebook page. Uh, the Stations of the Cross. Last year, we recorded them as I led them at the cathedral. I lead them every Friday uh, when I'm in town uh, at 6 p.m. If you're here, living here, uh, you're more than welcome to join us. Or if you're visiting, the Stations of the Cross are a wonderful way for us to enter into the mysteries. I remember as a little kid, I remember uh, someone asked about suffering. I was at a Theology on Tap, and a college girl asked me about suffering. And I told her, uh, I learned about suffering by going to the Stations of the Cross. I loved them as a kid. I still do. It's not Lent without them. Uh, and so I just really encourage you, uh, if it's been a while since you've been to the Stations of the Cross, uh, please take a look uh, at your parish church if you, when they celebrate them. If they do, that you're able to, uh, to join there or get yourself a book of the Stations and pray them at home. Uh, but to really see that the Stations of the Cross on our church walls are not there just for decoration, right? They're an encouragement that Jesus is with us. He suffers with us, right? And we suffer with him. And so as I come to you on this first Friday of Lent, know my prayers and pray for me as well. God bless you now.